In this video, we're going to introduce the business model. We're going to talk about how the business model is the story of how the company works. We're going to introduce the three dimensions of the business model, value creation, value delivery, and value capture. And we're going to talk about how to design and innovate business models. So what is a business model, Sino? Well, think of it as the story of how a company works. Music, for instance. How do we get access to music? Uh, think of the old days, then we used to buy records. Today, we stream music. This requires another business model for the company who gives us access to music. This is a, an interesting point, because sometimes you buy the music from one kind of company, let's say a record store, which is like a regular store, other times you buy it from a service provider, like, like something like Spotify, for instance. Mm -hmm. Or YouTube, where you can get, get it for free. And all of those examples are different business models that offer you the same basic thing, access to the music that you want to listen to. But how it is offered is different, in the form of a physical record, in the form of a downloadable MP3 file, or in the form of a streamable steady stream of mu music from a platform like Netflix, for instance. So this is different both from the point of view of the consumer and from the point of view of the company. From the point of view of the consumer, you've been offered something different, the physical record versus, let's say, the streamable track. In one case, you own it, and in the other case, you don't. And then also from the point of view of the company, there's a difference because um, Spotify, for instance, doesn't look anything like a classic physical record store. They are two very different kinds of companies based on two very different kinds of business models. Mm -hmm. And also, the payment is different. In the record store, you pay for each record. When you stream, you pay once a month, for instance, and you get access to all the music that you want to. So this requires a different kind of organization, two different kinds of organization, to be able to deliver this to the customer. So what we're talking about here are different business models, different ways of creating, delivering, and capturing value. Those are the three components of the business model, and any business model needs to answer those three questions. How do I create value, and for whom? How do I deliver that value reliably and over time? And how do I make sure that I capture value from those transactions so that I can make a profit? So let's dig a little deeper into those three concepts. How a company creates, delivers, and captures value. Value creation is about what you offer the customer. That can be a product or a service of the com or a combination of the two. And the point is that that offering solves a problem for the customer. You have to deliver this as an organization, right? And then you need resources, you need activities, and sometimes you need partners as well. And value delivery can be very different depending on what you offer as a product or a service, for instance. And also, value delivery leads to some costs. It is costly to acquire resources. It's costly to carry out activities. So this is important also for the profitability that is the value capture. Mm -hmm. So here the, the logic of profitability, in the, the costs, the income, but also in, in which way do you receive money uh, for in, in the transaction? Uh, going back to the, the record store again, there you receive money for each record. And in the streaming, then you capture a value uh, by getting paid once a month. So value capture is also one of the aspects of the business models where companies really differentiate themselves from each other by offering solutions to the customers that are based on different payment models. A company needs to redesign their business model. In the first place, it needs to be designed. How do we create value? How do we deliver it? And how are we supposed to capture value from our activities? Business models are often referred to as a sort of architecture. That is, value creation, value delivery, and value capture need to be connected. They need to fit together in a meaningful way. And that means that sometimes you change that architecture. You just don't change one little thing, but you, in some sense, rebuild the entire business model. To survive and grow for a company in the music industry, it needs to, to redesign this business model. They cannot create value in the same way as they used to do. They cannot deliver it in the same way, and they need to find new ways of capturing value. Sometimes companies redesign their business models because they want to be more profitable. 
Other times it could be because they want to become more sustainable. So the point is that sometimes there are drivers that require companies to design their business models in new ways. We started this video by asking, what is a business model? And we tried to describe it by using these three main concepts, how to create value, how to deliver value, and how to capture value. Sometimes companies need to rethink how they create, deliver, and capture value. And sometimes they find that they need to innovate their business models to ensure that they are fit for the future.